In this video, we're going to learn how to count the number of letters in a string using Python. Now there's a lot of ways we could solve this problem. We'll first solve this problem using a more traditional technique with a loop. So let's say we have a string text that's equal to open 24 hours a day. There are 13 letters in this string. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine, and then 10, 11, 12, and 13. What we'll do is create a for loop to loop through the string one character at a time. And as we do, we'll keep a running count of the number of letters we've encountered so far. We'll have here a variable count that we initialize to zero. This variable is going to keep track of the running count of the number of letters that we found so far. Then we'll have a for loop with for C in text. So this loop body is going to run for each character in the string. And each time it does, C is going to be set to that next character in the string from the first character in the string all the way to the last character in the string. Now, technically C is a string made up of one character and strings have an is alpha method that will return true if the character C is a letter and false otherwise. So we could have an if statement here with if C dot is alpha returns true, then we're going to increment the count by one with count plus equals one to acknowledge that we have found another letter. So this loop will go through the string one character at a time. And only if that character is a letter is the count going to be incremented. So by the end of this loop's execution, count is going to store the number of letters in the string. We could output that count here with print and we'll have total letters colon and then we'll output the count. And if we save the program and give it a try here, We'll get here that we have 13 letters total, which is correct. Now we could solve this problem with one line of code if we use what's called a list comprehension. So we could have a list comprehension here with C dot is alpha for each character C in the string text. And the way the list comprehension works is that for each character C in the string text, the is alpha method is going to be called and the true and false return values from these method calls are going to be the items of this list. We could output the list using print. And if we save the program and give it a try, we can see here the items of the list correspond to the return values of the is alpha method calls because this letter here corresponds to the first true item and the space character here corresponds to this false item. And then we have two more false items for the two digits that follow. So what we could do is count the number of true values in this list and that's going to be the number of letters in the string. We could use the count list method to do that. We could have here dot count true. And this is going to return the number of true items in that list. We could store that into a variable called count. And then we could output that count here with print total letters colon, and we'll output the count. Then if we save the program and give it a try, we get that we have 13 total letters, which is correct. So this is how we can count the total number of letters in a string using Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.